Hey. So here's a thing. It's called Dementium. Is that how you say that? Dementium? Dementium? Or Dementium? Remastered. I've never played the original, so I don't really know what to expect, but I figure well, we'll check it out for an hour. Let's see what it's all about. This is um, from a very good developer. I'm going to be casual and, and choose normal because I'm not looking to impress anyone. You're on Vine Sauce, you're looking for me to impress you? Jeez. <gasps> okay. Um, look around with the stylus. There it is. Circle pad. Oh, you can kind of play this. I'm assuming if this was new 3DS, I could use the, um, the nipple. Alright, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna give you guys some more screen real estate. Since it seems like that screen... ...doesn't really... doesn't really have a lot. It's just heart rate. Let's try that. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, that's good. Alright, let's try that. Um, yeah, I've heard good things about this game. I've heard that this was one of the best horror games on the DS. Now, I know what you're thinking. The DS? There's good- wait, wait, horror games? It's graphics- It's graphics aren't that impressive. So how could there be anything immersive on the DS? But that's apparently not the case with this game. A notepad with uh, most of its pages torn out. Why did you do it is written on the front page. I did- what did I do? Why did you draw the penis? This is an emergency. Everyone must evacuate the building. Locate the nearest stairwell. This is an emergency. Everyone must evacuate the building. Locate the nearest stairwell. Okay. Sorry, I had to adjust the volume. This is an emergency. This is an emergency. Welcome. Welcome to the building. It's a newspaper. The headline reads, Man brutally murders wife. Holy shit. I don't remember any of that. I've been with her for 34 years. Oh, there's the butt butcher. Who was that? And why was he the troll from Lord of the Rings? So this is a remaster. I think they increased the graphics. They increased them very, very, very slightly much to make this fit the 3DS. I think the lighting is what got a lot of attention. Oh, uh, there's a... okay. It's not 5643. That's the only password I know. I'm 
pretty sure they tried to get this out before Halloween, but Nintendo did not approve it in time. Nintendo was very slow in approving this game. That's what I learned on Twitter as it was happening. I was actually hoping this would have been out before Christmas. Before Christmas. Before Halloween. So I could stream it. On Halloween. This was going to be a Halloween game. But, uh, it just recently came out. So... Wait, have I not been in this room? Oh god. Oh god, I'm getting lost already. This is an emergency. Oh, okay, we're having problems. Um, I'm not dropping any frames. So, if I'm offline, it's Twitch. Not Verizon this time. I'll be right back. Oh, I'm back. YouTube is shit out of luck. It's Restream.io. It's the middleman that I use between this and YouTube. And that is the problem tonight. So, YouTube is shit out of luck. But I'm back. So, I figure it's better than not streaming. So, if you missed a little bit, this is an emergency. Everyone must evacuate the building, turn around or something. I don't know. Go to the nearest stairwell. So there's a lot of, uh, a lot of old shit, a lot of blood, man brutally murders wife, um, there's, oh, wait, there's a penis there. Okay, so, yeah, we don't need that, um, Bueller, oh, Bluler, sorry, Bluler. So, yeah, I'm in some kind of ward. Isn't that some shit? What an, what an original setting. Creepy. Mainly with the blood all over the place. Let's see if there's any... Let's see if there's any motherfuckers that have a, a code of some sort. Hmm. Uh, there doesn't seem to be a key or a code over there, so I have to find some kind of code. Zero, eight, one, okay. Zero, eight, one, three, nine, nine, okay. It looks like, it kind of looks like a, a man dolphin is holding this flashlight. Are you guys getting that feeling, or is that just me? Like a flesh-colored dolphin fin, or dolphin mouth, is just holding the flashlight. Zero, eight, one, oh, whoops. Oh, shit. Zero, eight, one, three, nine, nine. Zero, eight, one, three, nine, nine. Did it. I beat the game. Alright, that sounds really familiar. What is that noise? Okay, I can beat the shit out of some demons, I guess. The gun cage is locked. One of these shotguns sure would be handy. How dare you show me a shotgun and not give it to me right away? Mm. 
Yeah, that is a very golden eye sound. Is it? Is it golden eye? Is it actually from golden eye? That that alarm, that klaxon. That's actually what it's called. It's called a klaxon. C l a x o n. C o c k s o n. Ah, peels. So this is a survival horror type game in first person. If you hadn't been able to discern that. And... Again, this was a very highly regarded game when it first came out on the DS. And I had never played the original. This is made by Renegade Kid, who also did... Um... Murderer. Who also did... Mutant Muds. And... That little Metroid game on, on the 3DS. What the hell was the name of that one? Moon. They did Moon. Which this plays very similar to Moon. And... It, it's really, really solid, actually, control-wise. <laughs> they just disappear. It was called- Zeo Drifter. Zeo Drifter is the other- is like the Metroid-like game that, uh, that they made. And I actually interviewed Jules. That's his name. And he's a cool dude. So I wanted to take- I wanted to take a look at this game and see if it was any good. Remember, this is a review copy. I, I talked about this on the Two on the Vine podcast with KY. I'd like to explain the difference between a paid promotion and a review copy, because I think this- this comes up pretty often. With a review copy, you're- <laughs> See ya. Yeah, with a review copy, you're basically allowed to review the game. And you can, you know, be honest and say how you feel about it. Those, I get sometimes, if I'm lucky. A paid promotion is what some YouTubers do. And if you think a video might be a paid promotion, check the description. Legally, you have to announce that you're accepting money in exchange for a video. And if you don't, that is a big problem. Those are the things you can't say bad things about. So, if you're ever concerned that a YouTuber is taking the shekels, that's how you find out. Legally, we have to admit that kind of stuff. So. But yeah, I mean, if I don't like this game, that's my own- uh, I risk not getting further review copies, but I've- Unfortunately, uh, have had that happen a number of times, where developers will refuse to work with me again, because I've utterly destroyed their game live on stream. But most times, I'm- you know, I try to be fair, if possible. So there you go, now you- now you know. And not to put myself on a pedestal, but I have not taken the shekels to this day. I was once offered many, many shekels, but I refused. So, still going strong, guys. Still going strong. When I'm in a corner doing heroin, then maybe the shekels will be mine. But until then, until then, it's all good. Not a single shekel has traded hands. Get bit by bugs, take pills. Oh, you can step on them, I guess. Let's see what the map looks like. Oh, oh my. Oh my, this is a fucking big game. I had no idea it was this expansive. Uh, okay. Well, the <laughs> I don't think I'll be streaming this whole game, but I, I really- I was curious about this thing for quite a while, so... That- <laughs> that- that sound effect does- it doesn't sound like bugs so much as it sounds like a bear fapping in the woods. That's the distinction. 
No, I don't think people, uh, J-Man, I don't think people are necessarily sellouts. That's a word that people like to toss around a lot. If you take a paid promotion, that doesn't necessarily mean you're a sellout. You know, if you do a good video, I've seen some paid promotion videos that were well done. Um... I don't know. It's- it's hard to say. There's- it- it depends on how it's done. It depends on a lot of different factors, in my opinion. I don't know. However, that doesn't mean I would do- you know, if I accepted- if I started- Come on over and get me free cats, right? A little closer. Wait, you're not one of them. Oh man, we're gonna go- <laughs> What the fuck is this? Who is that guy? I saw his heart. That man had a big heart. I like this mixtape. This is a good remix. You know, if people, um, if I took, if I started calling out donations, people would say I'm a sellout. There's- you can't li like, you literally cannot do anything without someone calling you a sellout. It's just there are varying degrees of selling out in people's minds. Just the fact that I make money from YouTube videos, that in and of itself, I am a sellout. But I'd rather be- I'd rather be a sellout and be happy than be a miserable fuck and be like, NO! I won't take any of this. Oh shit, my computer is turning off. Hang on a second. Oh, that's a good time to pause. Hang on, let me- let me change my, uh... Um... Power settings, good, got it. Done. Now that's... That's something that happened in every Windows. There's a lot of recoil on this gun. I could see that making for some interesting shooting. It's not just like press button many times and enemies automatically die! Again, this started out as a DS game. I'm not really too crazy about the animations and the way the enemies die, but that being said, it started as a DS game, so I guess I understand. Who was that guy that died? And like, what was his deal? His just—he was just a big like bear man. Speaking of a bear fapping in the woods, okay. There's the little girl. No horror story is complete without the little girl. I don't know, this is pretty good. Doola Doobie Star might be a little bit better. Uh, I do like the atmosphere. See, crying children don't freak me out because creepy f crying children. Crying children freak me out just because children need to stop. That that's it. The sound of a child crying is also the sound of 
a life being washed down the drain. Nah, could you believe if I was really that cynical? I am. I actually am. I like this TV show. Spinning Red Portal. That's my favorite TV show. It's on in all of the psychiatric wards. So wait, my max HP is 42? Because it says 42 over there. Like, it says HP 42. That's an odd number to have as a max HP number. can't see shit unless you have the flashlight on. So at some point, I'm wondering if I'm gonna get a weapon with a flashlight attached to it. Because that would- that would be- well, that would be kind of cheap. Do you remember in Doom 3? How you couldn't use a flashlight and a weapon at the same time? And it was a creative choice. And then they later went back on that in like, I think there was some HD version of Doom 3. Where they attached a flashlight to a weapon. The BFG edition. Oh, it was a mod for that too? Computer noises. Wait, wait, that doesn't sound like just any old computer noise. That sounds like technology. I don't know what the hell that is, actually. Sure is a loud computer. Unless it's not a computer and it's a bomb. Oh! Oh, no, 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 there's just, like, living, uh, teeth flashlights in there. That's what that is. I see now. It's a cool hospital. Where they're, they're literally keeping, like, flesh cock socks. Or as I like to call it, anti-penis devices. Actually, those kind of looked like a miniature version of the barnacle from Half-Life, to be completely honest. It's a piano book. Oh, I want it. Can I take it? No, I can't take it. gonna give me the opportunity to play the piano. Nice. D E A D.
This guy are sick. Okay, dead. D. D A uh, D E, and then. D. D. So C D. That's the A. I always I'm terrible at keyboard. When it comes to like Yeah, I can play by sound, but I don't I'm not by I'm not a pianist. P and Nist. It's blatant. Blatant advertisement. Shit game. <laughs> nah, it's good. Why did I not see this one happening? That's some nice noises. Oh, that's some nice squishiness. It's good. I, I hear more. How does a piano open a door? I never- I never understood that at games. Oh, they're babies. Oh, they're just babies. They're cute. Don't worry about them. They can't hurt you. Where is that? Is that a blocked hallway? So, Konome, Imakuni, and myself. Oh god. We went to what's called the Grease Trucks today, which is on the uh, Rutgers College campus, Rutgers in New Jersey. Um, they moved the Grease Trucks. There used to be more of them. Um, now there's only one of them, unfortunately. But, this is something I think we, we decided to do while I was streaming, like, they were in the chat, and we were like, yes, we have to go. So we finally did it, we finally went, and it was this one truck called Are You Hungry? I swear to god, that's the name of the truck. And let me tell you what I had for dinner. This is going to gross some of you out and make others very hungry. I had, in a sandwich, cheesesteak, like, so there was, like, steak, cheese, chicken fingers, french fries, and mozzarella sticks, and honey mustard, in bread. That was what I had for dinner tonight. And that's the kind of shit you can get, like, I could have gotten lettuce, tomato, and bacon on that as well. I could have gotten jalapeno poppers, that kind of shit. I think I, I think I might be dead. I, there's a chance that I'm already dead. I'm not sure. God, what is this? What, what? Slugs, please. Uh, it was a little bit, there's, okay, a problem with the sandwich, it was a little cold. If it was hotter, it would have been better, and also there were too many fries on it. Yeah. Yep, that is my complaint. 
there were too many fries on it. It would have been better if I had a chance to taste more of the, the chicken and the meat. But, uh, unfortunately, it was very fry-y. Apparently, these grease trucks used to be, like, classic. They were legendary. And then they ended up... That's the other game, yeah, Zeo Drifter. They ended up scattering the trucks. And I, I ended up going to the wrong part of the campus. Also, Rutgers has a fucking huge campus. Like, my god. It took me 10 minutes just to get from one side of the campus to the other side, which I'm su I'm assuming isn't really that out of the ordinary for big colleges. My college was a lot smaller, but it was fucking huge, man. And uh, I went scouring for the rest of the food trucks, but could not find them. And then I realized it was just a lost cause, so I ended up... Um, I ended up just having that one food truck. They have like... Yeah, they're, they're called fat sandwiches, that's what they call them. Like, they don't make any... any uh, <laughs> they don't try to hide what they are. They don't make any... illusions about the fact that you're eating a gross, horrible for you sandwich. Oh god. Oh god. Light or fight? Take your pick. You don't really get to carry too much ammo either. Yeah, so far it's 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 a pretty what makes it good is the fact that it's on the 3DS. And previously it was on the DS. That's that's why people lost their shit over this game when it came out. Like a lot of people told me this was a very good game. And it's it's solid. Definitely could see myself getting into it. But on the DS it looked you know, it was still able to do this graphically, just not as good. And being able to get like a kind of a portable horror game like this, I would imagine was pretty big deal for a lot of people. So that's, that's my, that's my guess. No. Okay, time to just shoot into the dark and hope for the best. Okay. Yeah, the 3DS capture card works fine. It's not a card, it's a USB. The uh, 3DS has its own capture method. So that's good. It's just my my Aver TV HD capture card doesn't work. Shit. I wonder if you can get addicted to pills in this game. Maybe I've just been playing too much Fallout. I haven't tried everything yet. I'm gonna try a few more things to see if the cap card can work. Like I said, it's either an incompatibility with shitty Windows 10, or it's it's something related to my motherboard, which 
a number of people seem to think. But this worked right away. And then again, this is USB. And, well, that doesn't make a difference, right? If it works, it works. Oh my god, can, can we stop with the penises? Nope. Nope. <laughs> Running away. I'm gonna do this next area. Because the map is kind of coming to an end here. I'm kind of curious. It's locked. Kind of curious. It's the beginning of Metal Gear Solid Five. Fuck off. Hey, is this reception? Can I leave? Wait, this isn't reception. What is this? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh. Oh, okay. So that's the thing. <laughs> I'm almost dead. Um. Y'all got any more of those pills? No? I. <laughs> no, do not kill, do not kill, I need to- Oh, shit! Try that one more time. When you shoot them, they go backwards, so at least there's that. I mean, Jesus Christ, they do a lot of damage, but still. You can- you can shoot them and they will fly backwards. Chapter 4, The Cleaver. Chapter 5, The Cleveland Steamer. Oh, please let there be a Cleveland Steamer. 
Is that, is that a person or a doll? She pointed at me. She pointed at me. Her leech minions have found me. So I watched Ant-Man in full, finally, and, um, I have a, an official review of Ant-Man. Are you ready? It was good. That's my review of Ant-Man. G-U-D. I don't really have a whole lot else to say about Ant-Man. Uh, it was, it was, it was fun, and it was creative, and I liked, I liked that it wasn't your normal superhero movie. It was kind of funny. The, oh god, the action set pieces being in like small locations were really good. Oh my god! Yeah, and generally, it, whoa, voice, voice, please. <laughs> generally, it was it was a good movie. I enjoyed it. Also, Red Letter Media reviewed Krampus, and they loved it. Mike went as far as to say he thought it was a perfect movie, which kind of blew my fucking mind. I never expected that. For a movie called Krampus. And, and now I'm actually curious about the movie Krampus. Body bag survival guide. One of those bodies is going to come to life at some point. If one of those bodies doesn't come to life, then I'm rioting. Perhaps you seek the truth. The truth is all lies. Purloined of their youth. Count the dead men's eyes. Oh. Per purloined? The dead men's eyes. <laughs> Watch some securities. That's, that's Jules' name. Um. Well, I am curious. I kind of want to... Dead men were there. There is one, two, so it's two eyes. That's four eyes. It's five eyes. Or, no, six. <laughs> I can do math. Eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, 
four, five, six, that's twelve. That will be where I stop. What the fuck? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Just curious if there's anything crazy around this corner. Maybe a boss of some kind, I don't know. Oh, oh, that's a new enemy. Spitter. Okay, he leaks from his lungs. He, he leaks. Cigarette tar from his lungs. He is a walking advertisement for anti-tobacco. It's kind of- it's actually kind of hard to put down. The sense of progression is pretty decent. It's, uh, pretty good. Pretty good for a DS game. So that's the key here. I think there's a lot of people that are like, this isn't that impressive. But remember, this was a DS game that was just remastered for the, um, for the 3DS. But they, aside from graphics, it looks like, um, they improved the controls as well, I've been told. So... It's alright. I like it. I don't really have... I don't think I'm going to be continuing it, but... It was pretty good. So... There's that. My official review of the first 30 minutes of the game is... Don't smoke. Don't be a joke. Alright, so... Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to take a quick break. I'm going to get something to drink, um, and when I come back, we're going to do uh, the Final Fantasy VII remake trailer, the gameplay trailer. I want to talk about it a little bit. We'll kind of go frame by frame, not frame by frame, but I'll kind of talk about a few uh, moments, and then we'll talk about the episodic stuff, because a lot of people have been emailing me and tweeting me, and they want to know what I think. So instead of doing it while I'm playing something else, I figured we'll just fuck it. We'll just watch the trailer together and we'll talk about it. And I'll see what you guys think about it too. So I'll be back very, very shortly with my thoughts on Final Fantasy VII Remake, the quest for more money. Be right back. <laughs> 